Make them turn off that defibrillator, please. Hi, guys. Hiya. So we have Darian here. We said Natalie outside for him. The university student. I know I want to do everything for the life. I don't want nobody to say, I did not talk to him behind camera. First time I ever go meet him. So when Natalie comes, she got all the camera. She got outside for him. So Darian, for anybody on Facebook who does not know, is a student. Oh, he's here. Oh, good afternoon, Darian. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Oh, you take so long to come. Oh, you lost the staff. All right, you can come and sit right here beside Auntie Dana. Yes, um, sit down. You can sit. Not a little bit of water. Want the water? All right, you can pull off the mask so that we can see. So, before I do this interview with Darian, right? Um, I was on my live on YouTube and Darian called me, nobody had asked for some assistance to pay his school fee at the end of Edna Manley School of is, is Dance, School of or Edna, Man, Edna Manley College of the Visual and Performing Arts. He told me about his situation and donors and um, some has, has already started sending, but you know, Auntie Dana don't just give out donation like that or put people on the program like that. You have to do a sit down. So guys, you're gonna come with me while Auntie Dana interview Dorian. So I'm gonna turn the camera on Dorian. Natalie, you can come now, please. Please hold it that they can see both of us. They can see both of us. Well, good, good afternoon, Dorian. Welcome to Planka Shop. Um, so first and foremost, how did you know about Auntie Dana? Um, I've always listened to Speak a little program. loud. Well, I always listen to your program and yeah. so on. Um, hear person stuff about you. And I really um, like the way you're doing, you're helping out persons. But until I'm in this situation where we really need help, and like, I was talking to my supervisor and she was saying, you could call Dana and I don't like the camera to me now, but to be honest, even though we do um, performing art, yes. but to be honest, I'm mostly on the education side, so yes. the whole camera and thing, yeah, so. <laughs> okay, let me give you, I never give you this part. So my program, right, as you say, you see, it, is based on social media. Yeah. Um, for you to get help, social media has to see you, yeah. and everything that you say to me is on this World Wide Web. You will be open up to criticism, backlash, person saying all manner of things about you. But what you have to remember that is social media, the help is going to be coming from. So in other words, for you not to feel any way, you have to put on a thick skin. And when I say a thick skin, person, you want to say stuff about you. Because, you know, on social media, we cannot control what people write or what people might say. You have to just put on a thick skin like Auntie Dana and say, I'll say, watch ya. Anything you want to say, talk, or anything you want to do. And that is the kind of perception, you know? You have to go forward with well, welcome. So give me a little info about yourself and for those who see me for the first time. So I am, I am Dorian. I am a, I am a humble person. Easy going. I, I love the career that I choose, which is drama and education. Um, my, where I want to reach in life, basically, is to become a drama therapist. This is the first thing of becoming a teacher. And um, I am not from the religious family. I'm not from the religious family. I'm from the religious family. I'm from a poor family. Yeah, and, um, I took student loan from the first year or up to the third year. However, when I went there to do for them to renew it man, for renewing, renewing it for, for this year, mm -hmm. they told me that the guarantor cannot be cannot cannot stand guarantor for me for this year. 
and um, I need to get a, a different guarantor. And you know, anybody know that guarantor, getting guarantor is very hard. hard. And persons don't really want to, you know, they, they, they don't want to take on that responsibility. Um, I really understand uh, as well that being a guarantor is a lot of responsibility. It's a lot of risk. And um, I've heard of situations where persons that and guarantor for persons and they, 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 they don't pay and so they have, have to know. pay it back yes. yes so um okay go ahead so that is a setback for me in terms of paying my school fee no when i went to the school they told me that um that you can come up with a hundred and fifty thousand mm -hmm. you know, um the parents of that um i still get to attend class same way, but in terms of getting grades and all of that, um, I will be able to get those stuff and other little things that you know come with being a school thing where that is concerned. Okay. So um, I am seeking assistance. Okay. Um, listening to you just now, you say you are from a poor background. Could you give me a little info? Where are you from? Um, who helped you thus far into school, etc. Well, to be honest, I am originally from, I was born in Kingston, yeah. I moved from Kingston when I was eight to St. Elizabeth to live with well, my mom, my mother, my grandfather, my grandmother, that was my business. Yeah. Um, my mother actually, she she was, um, she said 90 and oh, she said so, she so, so, oh, she said 90. You know, she was, she would come to Kingston from St. Elizabeth and so, and unaware to persons and to be honest um, my mother she used her profits basically what she had and um, paid for my sexy and from ever since then her business is just smash up because wow. of that wow. so she took that big risk for me and to be honest why I really reach out for her because I just want to leave her forward. Okay. Okay. I just want to meet her forward. I just want her I just want her to see me um, walk up and get that degree and get my masters and become something that you know, that, I won't say something, but speak up. They're not hearing you. I want, I want, outside. I want, I want to become that teacher. I want to become that role model for not only my family but other persons that will eventually, I will eventually teach. And um, yeah. Okay, so you have any siblings? I do have sister, sister, brother, mm -hmm. a brother, as I should say. Yeah, um, they, they basically would, would say they are not in a position to, to help, help yeah. because they are, they, are, they, are, they are struggling as well. They are trying to start out their own life, you know, everybody has their own challenge. Mm -hmm. But, you know, we just, like, I would, I would, I'm greatly appreciated, I would be appreciated. I appreciate yeah. it if I get the help at school. Yeah. Okay, Darian, very interesting story. So, um, how many more years do you have left in school? Well, to be honest, I this year should Speak be my, a little low this before. year. This year should be my first year. Sorry, my fourth year. My fourth year. However, I have some course that I dropped and. Um, because one, I I also have a challenge where um, if anybody know of a thing called dyslexia, where you you learn your learning um, mm -hmm. process mm -hmm. is different from everybody else. So while a person can take two or three hours or two hours and study, I have to take four or five hours to actually study to, to um, retain things and to process things the way I um, to relate them 
Okay, so that's that that was that is one of my biggest challenges, which the college knew about it. Okay. Um, I also, being the fact that I touched that, um, that I touched that, I also want to use this medium as well to, to, to just to encourage other persons that no matter what process you are going, um, process it takes for you to achieve your goal, you can succeed no matter how long it takes. It can take you five, six years to get your degree or to get your master's for this year process. And you just have to go through it humble and um, take it one step at a time with grace, with grace, with the grace of God. Amen. Yeah. Um, you basically say that you do drama. Um, um, could you explain to persons who are watching who doesn't understand what influences them to want to be a drama teacher, um, why choose drama, etc. For persons who don't know, when you say a drama teacher, they might not understand that it's right. like so play, a yes. theater. It's a theater perspective, and um, being a drama teacher, you know, it's like I would say theater. Let me use the word right word theater. Right, mm -hmm. theater is a sense. It is, is a is a is a thing that combines the whole art form together: music, dance, um, speech, you know, vocals, visual art. It 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 com it, it combine of it's a combination of everything. Because when you do put a play together, when you devise a play together, it, it, when you devise a play, it's like it com it, it's a combination of um, a visual art, it's a combination of music, it's a combination of dance, and as well as speech. Okay. So, teaching theater art and what we need to teach theater art is the joy that I get from it, is the, the feeling of being on stage. I wouldn't, I wouldn't say um, Imitating persons, but you know, you get character, you get you see people the way, the way people act. Yes, you, yes. you, you kind of get that feeling of okay, you know, I can be, be another person, character, yeah, yes. being somebody on stage. Yes, on stage. Secondly, um, it also helped to boost your self esteem as a person because it had helped me in that way, um, it had helped me in so many different ways, and thus far. I, I, um, hence why I want to become a drama therapist. Because if you, if you know, well, if you know, with, with, with theta art as well, it's like a, it's like a, a therapy itself. Because yes, when you're in the theater, it takes your mind. You are trying to play the character that you are supposed to. Play. It just put you into a different feel, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yes. but not only that, but. In a therapy, it, 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 it helps in a therapeutic therapeutic way where um, you you can you can express yourself, express that in that emotion. Yes, express, bring bring yeah, out a different yeah. side to you basically. Yeah. That person would not normally see. Yeah. Yes, depends on the script. Well, very interesting, guys. And um, Dorian, 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 what is your name? Dorian. Dorian, yes, as you can see, a young man with a lot of dreams, wanting to finish his third his education, but um, does not have the funds to do so. And this is where Auntie Dana will step in. Um, this is where I come in to get the funds for him. So what I'm going to basically do, Dorian, you're on the live right now. Persons are gonna watch you from all over the world. It's gonna also be on my YouTube channel. So those over there who don't use Facebook will also see every donation that we get that I'm gonna explain how my program runs. So watching now, donors are gonna see and they're gonna call. I'm gonna give them the opportunity um, to ask you a few questions if they wish to. I'm gonna use my charity phone here in a few minutes. Not yet, guys. So what happens with my program is Donors are going to be watching, you know, I have my blanket nation, and they will then choose if they wish to support you. When they do that, they will send the donation to me. When, they, when I get the donation, I will have to call. No, I'm not going to call. 
I'm going to do it just like how I did the university student. They're going to send the donation and they're going to state specifically that it's for Darien. When I receive the, the donation, they're, they're going to send a name for them to be known. So suppose uh, Marcia right here wants to send Dorian a hundred dollars. She's going to send a hundred dollars and she's going to say towards Dorian's school fee. And it's from Jack Puss and Jack Puss the name. And then when I'm giving it out, it calls. So there's no donation that can come to Auntie Nana for you and it does not call out. So it's a two-way thing. Here where the donation comes and receives, um, and the donor watching to hear he or she name. I've never had a donor who sent any donation to me and don't want to hear the name call or don't hear the name call. So that is how the program basically goes. The second thing that I want to tell you, your donation is for school, right? So whenever I get the donation, I will go directly to the school to pay over the donation. I will have to ask the school permission to use my camera just for evidence to pay it over to go in and ask them. I was told that already. And then it will be done on live and the donors can see that their funds was. So none of the donation will be handed over to you. So right now you are in a raise of what you say, 150,000? 150,000 is what they told me. You have to pay. You have to pay what is coming How much is it? Okay, let me see. So he's gonna show me some things, guys. Do you want me to put this out there? Yeah. Okay. Um, so this is this is what students. So yeah, basic. Oh, this, this, oh, this, oh, this, is, what, this is what. So you owe two hundred and thirty thousand dollars. This is not a lot for Auntie Dana to get. Um, this is what I also owe the city So he's in a rear of two hundred and thirty thousand, and no, and you owe the school how much? Come up with the camera, I'm not telling you. Where it is. This is the old school. So it's so it's you hold the school two hundred and thirty plus you are in arrears of how much now? Two hundred and thirty so for this year. So for this, this year. Is what I so in all it's two thirty you owe? Well no. It's two thirty. Okay, we can come down a little closer. This but this 230, this let, me, let me hold it, Natalie, just to clarify. Hold on to this. this. So this 230, this right? This 230 is for my school for this year. For this year? Yeah. So you're in arrears. Yeah. It says 230,761, right? Yeah. And but around here now, what you're saying is that you, you owe them from last year. Yeah. So you still owe them two hundred and thirty thousand yeah. for last year. Okay, can you show me please? So you owe like four hundred and something thousand? Yeah. Okay. Alright. So you owe at least four hundred and sixty thousand dollars, yes. Um, hold on to this for me. And it said the Edna Manley College of the Visual Art. And this is your semester on campus, March eleven. Um, Dorian. Yeah, the school, the, the courses that I did last year. Oh, and these are the courses that he did last year. Yeah. Yes. Oh, you got Section A credits. I don't know. Yeah, the credits. Those are only the credits. Okay, those are only the credits. Yeah. And what is the credits? These are the credits. Oh, what you get? Okay. No, no, these are not like the grades or anything. These okay. Are just the, the courses that I did. Okay. Um, hold on to this, Natalie. Let me just see. If I can read some of the comments. So, if there's anyone on here who um, would like to ask Darian any question, uh, somebody said, I really hope she get the help. You don't have to really hope anymore. He's right here in Planka Shop, and I'm not talking with water into my mouth. I will get the help for Darian. Um, it said, I can do all things through Christ who threatened Auntie Dana, and Auntie Dana is putting in the place. As a matter of fact, some of my donors have already started sending donations for him. So we are going to hear, we are going to do a little mini marathon for Darian. Uh, for those who knows how to donate to the program already, you can go through the channels that you guys know, or call Miss Paula at 999 6822 and she will give you information and if you want to send it to Zell or to Rushmore or to, um, she will give you the information on to 
who you can donate the donation to and we'll do it just like how we do it for the other university student it will be done live on camera all right so i'm going to let you guys speak to dorian let me send out marcia she's going to look for my mommy for me today so dorian talk to them and you have the phone right here you can answer while i get up for a minute they will call you and they will so when you see the phone ringing this one you have um have so many message so guys if you want to speak to dorian and ask him anything personally you can call and he has the phone right in front of him so he's gonna answer you right and ship over to that one dorian yeah i'm coming right look in the live and let them see a beautiful face oh. yes Marcia. Oh, yes. oh. Oh. Good afternoon. <laughs> good afternoon. <laughs> yeah. Dorian. No, this is Auntie Donna um phone. Oh, I think somebody was talk somebody talking about phone or something like that. Um, <laughs> I really don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> you say I should talk. Well, alright, so, um, a little bit about me. I am a humble person, as I was saying to Auntie Donna. I am a. I would say quiet. <laughs> I am a quiet person. So a lot of persons, when they like usually meet me, they say that, oh, you don't look like a drama person, but. For me, um, being a drama person doesn't mean that you have to be loud and out there and, you know, vulgar all the time. There's, it, there's a difference between being on stage and um, being you, your own self. And I really um, make a difference between me and my career that I really chose. Um, I know that when I'm on stage I can be anybody I want to be but when I'm when I'm me Dorian when I'm me Dorian I'm just me you know yeah so there is no there is no like there is no particular set way a drama person should should um, act yeah and I'm nervous to be here talking on live <laughs> with everybody watching so, um, apart from that, I, um, you can ask questions as what you don't say you can ask and I will answer you. Yeah, I know, in God, in God, in God, in God I trust, so true, so true, in God I trust. <laughs> <laughs> They're saying don't be nervous much. <laughs> um you don't know what happened to my phone. You was ringing? Well, somebody called but um Oh, oh but, but yes. So guys you see Dorian right Dorian. Dorian. Whoa, your name sounds similar, yeah. So we have Dorian right here, and you guys, um, sweet young man, you wishing you an abundance, yes, of blessing, yes. So Auntie Dana is right here. Um, you guys know the procedure. You guys know the procedure. Oh, listen, me, Natalie. You all know the procedure. Oh, we, oh, we, um, do donation over here. Um, we don't think we have to do any marathon, don't we? 
Because I know the procedure already. Send to Miss Paula or to who you always donate to. And we're going to get it and, we, and, and pay the school fee. So his school fee is 460 And that is my aim, right? Our aim is to pay the, the arrears from last year and pay the arrears this year. So it's a total of about Natalie, the phone ringing. I told you not even a look. A total. Hello, good afternoon. I am Donna. How are you doing? I am fine. I'm here watching Darian on your live. Yes. I, I want to donate to his medication. Yes. So. I want to like to donate a hundred dollars. Okay, I want to donate a hundred dollars. All right, call Paul and tell us to prepare for the phone for me now, please. So, you know the procedure. Is, is you, are you a first time donor? No. Okay. No, no. Okay, that means you know the procedure also, then. So, I would like to. Also, I would like to ask Dorian that when he finishes education, to give back to our students. Yes, I will. That is a must. <laughs> that is a must. So, part of it is um, giving back. Um, it's not okay. a case. It, well, it's not a case that, you know, getting help now and then um, after getting help and reaching at that um, stage, number show all the time. Sorry, reaching yeah. at that stage in life, I don't help others. My aim is always to help others. That is one of um, my uh -huh. biggest dream. Um, hence why I want, to, I want to become a drama therapist. That is one way of giving, but there are other ways I would like to give as well. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, that... okay. Thank you. And yes. Thank you for your help again. Yes. Uh, you might not get Paula right now, guys. You can leave her a message. I think she's at right. church. Yeah, I think Paula is at fasting service. So you might not get her now. But you know, those who have Carol, um, Zell or Keshap can reach out to Carol. Those who have Rushmar can reach out to Rushmar. Um, um directly all right curves by tina if you have the information miss paula is that church i just remember um hold on a second hello yes okay thank you thank you okay so my admin just told me that curves by tina and rush admin could you please pin um, Paula one also that curves by Tina and Rushmar information um, is pinned is pinned on on the line so um, please do that um, yes pin Miss Paula on so um, the admin just told me that the information yes Dylan mother I see you I see you, Dylan mother. I see you. Yes, so you guys know the procedure. Curse by Tina. Um, um, I, hold on, let me tell this person something. I told them agents. I'm okay, I'm gonna call that person. Yes, yeah, so the information is pinned there. Please, guys, again. When you send a donation, please give a contact. Hold on. Um, please give a contact information for... Please give... Hello, good afternoon. I told you that I'm in an interview. I will call you. Jesus. Yeah, who this? Me soon call you back. I don't want to interview. I'm doing an interview. I can go and call you back. I'm doing an interview here, yeah, but you can't see me now. Yes, yes. So, guys, um, oh, sorry about that, guys. So, the information is pinned right here. Um, and there for you to donate. Oh, don't put it up category. Yeah. Oh, yeah, wipe it off. Yeah. Me really. So how old are you, Dorian? I am 28. Oh yeah, 28. You look so young. 
What got to ask you that? So Dorian is 28 years old, and we write a very handsome young man. Somebody just said, yes, Dana, take off these negative people. Um, admin, please do your work. Admin, anybody over here negative, please block them with immediate effect. ASAP. So come prank Tertarians. Please, um, please look out for them. They don't want anybody over here to bring up anybody name who gone past from this program or anything. Please may I ask you not to block them on fire. All right? Yes. Even if it's a plank at here and them come with negativity to today, block them, all right? Thank you. No place like home, definitely. He definitely looks younger. I anti good day to you. And I, um, when I went, to, I told you that, I, yeah, oh, you know about it, right? That I did went to the school. Mm -hmm. Just wanting to clarify that you, what you tell me was true. You go to the school. I never got here to get your file, as some people say. Because I could have never got here and asked to give me, for them to give me a file. I just wanted to confirm mm -hmm. that you are indeed a student there. And uh, although the man was very harsh, um, him sound very harsh. The young Miss at the front, Miss, Miss Hyatt. Miss Hyatt. She was very polite to me. So cool to you, Miss Ayat. Big up yourself. You were so manageable. You were so respectful. Um, I don't know the gentleman when he said that was there, but he was not that pleasant. But he was telling me the truth anyways, but he wasn't pleasant. So um, stuff like that. Um, these people should come, should not come on your life. With, they come here. We're going to block them, so don't worry. Let them type. You know, we have admin right here working, and I think it's two admin I crawl up and down in other life. One don't talk and one always busy blocking. Yes. Um, only body what you don't want me to block, just, just go in the comment and say block this, let the admin them see it. Yes. Um, he was very harsh, but you know, sometimes you might meet people on a bad day, or you might, somebody might just hear about social media. And they don't know what it entails, and them just get upset. So, yes, yeah, so we're gonna come up with the, 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 the target is 460,000. If it goes over that, only one year, yeah, please. Well, yeah, after this, I'll just, um, and, and, and Dorian is from St. Elizabeth, and uh, only phone for me, please, Natalie. Turn it back this way, let me just do a little bit of talking. All right, give me back that one. Yes, thank you. So Dorian is from where you can send him back. What kind of basket them call it? Oh the Red Food Paris said best. And Dorian also is in Kingston and he works to help himself. He works at a call center. But Dorian, let me know that um the money that he works it has to assist him to pay the speak up a little low. He read somewhere, yes. Yeah, that's the one. And, um, you know, look after food and send it to work, so. And to basically, school, yes. So it's basically, so you don't put any of it towards your schooling? No, there's not enough Oh, for wow. So. Yeah, it's just to keep you to go to school. Yeah. So he's saying that that is a problem. What he's earning is not a lot and he has to pay 25000 you said? 25 total for the month, you pay a light bill too? Well, that's what the landlord is going to do. <laughs> landlord, please may I ask if you have a little leniency on this young man, so she couldn't just, they didn't give you a package that they charge you a light bill in him. Well, that was the plan, but it's not, it's not been written for us to say, you know. Oh. Because when I, when I moved there, it's just, you pay that amount for the light water and internet. So they're going to change it? Yeah. And they look somewhere cheaper. Well, that's what I'm trying to. Yes, if you can't afford it, don't put your hat which by your hand can't reach it. And you're already down in a area with the school fee. So you don't want to go, you understand? Put your hat somewhere else where your hand cannot even reach it. So, that's basically it, guys. Um, anything else? Natalie, I forgot to take the phone. To hear what they must say. Um, yeah, don't say we know what the procedure anti Dana. Um, yes, we know the procedure. 
Um, they know the procedure over here. They know how to donate bread basket. Yes. Auntie Dana and Obada go in uh, the house segment. Now we're not going into any house segment. I'm just asking for a little leniency. What you're saying, you are not alive and people is funny, really. He's not saying anything. We're not going any further. We not. We just was just saying for somebody message me and ask me, does he work to help himself? And I had to tell them that he asked to answer that question, that he works, but to the little that he works has to pay the rent for where he's boarding, cause he's not from Kingston. He's from Saint Elizabeth. All right, so. If you are any any of you on here would love have a one o'clock appointment so I can stay on here long um, to um, donate to Dorian school fee just call Rushmar Miss Paula she's at church now curved by Tina you can reach contact her via WhatsApp now on here Miss Carol and they will get the funds to Auntie Donna all right rent expensive um, Jamaica need more affordable living rentals. Why this morning? I don't think anything is going to get more affordable than what's going on. Because you soon hear even the, the, what you call it? The, the school fee them start with as to what's going on in and around. Because I bought two ton of steel a couple months ago. La, or, no, one more ton. But they buy one first and then we go back and buy one. That makes six ton. And this morning, they tell me that I need another ton. And when I call the hardware, it's 191,000 Jamaican dollars. They are ton of steel that I buy for 170, not even a month ago. So it's like twenty thousand dollar gone on the ton of steel. So we have to look for a lot of price increases now, guys. So um who to tell it might affect schooling it might to what is going on in and around the world you understand so everything is just escalating escalating going up everything going up um you understand so we hold on a second hi who is there okay yes yeah, so um, hold on, let me lock the phone here. Talk to them, man. Are you them want to see? <laughs> them see me every God Almighty dear. Every dear. Hello, good afternoon. Hi. No, good afternoon. Oh, you madam. She's doing good. You're on the live and you, and you call me on video. So what I can't. We never know live I go on. Yes, I'm on the live. I'm here with a university. Student trying to allocate some donation to pay off his tuition fee. All right, thank you. All right. Yeah, man, bless you. Yes, yes, yes. All right, you know, you know, some of the fun life. Just reading all the comments to see if any question in there to answer. Um, Big Thank you, um, Kachin, for sending off your donation already. Thank you. So, um, send it, the, the, these things to Miss Paula because she is the one that going to come to me with the name, stuff like that. Gypsy from Atlanta. Thank you. Thank you. Dear, dear. Okay. Thank you. You guys know the procedure already. And guys, we want to pay off everything by next week. So, we're trying to do this one can you do a little dance for us <laughs> <laughs> i can only sing you can sing I well can sing uh, uh, natalie if i go sing turn the camera he <laughs> said can only sing all right so come he never said more than a dance and say more oh, than that it's not a, not a dance so, um let's let you do um well, we can conceptualize everything here, then just now we'll come in and then place it. Oh, okay. Alright, well, let yeah. the singing for them. Um, yeah. Uh, when you're weary, feeling small. Wow. When tears are in, 
your eyes I will dry them all I'm on your side oh when times get rough and friend just can't be found like a bridge over troubled water I will lay me down like a bridge over troubled water I will lay me down <laughs> <laughs> Oh, can I hear what Oh, well, what church you both do? Well, when the back home, go to the um, library of the hospital in the church. You want? I'm um, still searching for a comfortable church in the life. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. But um, I have been attending the church from time to time. Uh, my father go to the King's Kingston, the previous Escarpment Road, the Kingston Church. Okay. But, I'm kind of contemplating because you know I'm pastor, so I'm like, thinking whether or not. Oh, um, so you like the yeah, yeah, I yeah. like I like the whole apostolic movement. Yes, and, yes. You know, not saying that this what is not. No, yeah, that's where yeah, 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 that's yes. where my heart. Is. Yes, I have to follow your heart. Yeah. Yes, wow. So you sing at church? When when I'm back home. Okay, hold on a second. Hello, hello. Good afternoon. <laughs> I call Auntie Paula for she at church now. Leave her a message and she go and get you to your ear. Alright. Mama Auntie Paula no pick up. Yeah, alright. Hello, good afternoon, Auntie Dana here. Hi, Auntie Dana. Hi. Can you please ask Maria if you can do a one month skip for us, please? A one month? A one month? Oh, they want to know if you can do a one person one skit. Person skit. Yes. So All right. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, can I do a live um, mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 I don't know. 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 Something that makes you feel comfortable. He's <laughs> <Is that laughs> <it? laughs> You always plan these things, you know. Yes, but when it reads like. Yes. Just give me some time. Yes, guys, you don't put him in yeah. you put him under pressure. Right. Yes. Yeah, don't put the right for this. Don't part. pressure him. Don't pressure <laughs> him, please. Ah, yes, but mm -hmm. One of Miss Lou. You can go ahead with that. That's nice. You thinking about one of Miss Lou points? Um, where um so. <laughs> yeah, they say that they are putting him on the spot. Can I do it in my story? Yes, you can. Anything that you want to do. 
It's up to you, not me. I didn't ask you to do anything, so I'm not taking no blame. Hello, good afternoon. Yes. Yes. That's true. I don't like it. I'm very upset about it. Why, why are these women on the planet here doing that? So definitely, that is true. You know, we are offering someone who wants to do this to the young man. The young man is very stressed. Can't you all see? I'm going to smile. You know, I know Auntie Donna, you did not have Auntie. These are people on the program. They have to be considerate. Definitely. The If you donate, him, just donate. If that, if him want to do, you ask him to sing, and he sing. If he had wanted to do something, then he would have done it. So, persons are very um, upset about the um, what the the, the, the caller asks. We can't stop people from saying what they want to say. As I told you, this is nobody not saying anything bad about you. Person just saying you know want to push you into any. Um, position that you don't, you are not comfortable in, you understand? And if they just want to donate, they can donate without you know, doing nothing. Yeah. They, they know a lot of persons who, as a matter of fact, not a lot, two persons who go to your school know a few and call me when I went there to say, Auntie Dana, I can vote for him. I am also in his class, etc. We know him. So, and then That's somebody right. from in the, sure they yes. They said to me, you know, um, you and I did not say, we really need my school to be paid. Yes. I really need to finish. And it's just like, in the, in, while I am saying this, it's just the fact that I have to under back on my head. So yes. I want my mother to be proud. Oh, that wow. That was one of the things, that the one of the biggest things my family paid for. Their, yes, um, My family, they are big on yes, education. Oh, wow. And, um, yes, Dorian. You know, yes, you have to, you have to reach somewhere in life. And for me, as a, as a young yes. male in this society, you want to reach somewhere in life. And, not, and when you look into the society, he's talking now on the life. Hold on a second. Not a lot of males want to go to a tertiary school. And when you're going to a tertiary classroom, you're, 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 you're compared to the female versus the male. A young man like me want to go in the classroom, it's my desire to be in the classroom, you know. I'm not going to force, I'm not forcing anybody what is just at the heart that I have. Want to reach other persons, want to reach out, help educate persons, you know, and um, I want to be a role model in the society to a lot of, a lot of um, kids. That's just my, that's just my heart desire. Yes, and we have a donor here who wants to talk to you. He said his daughter goes to Edna Manley. Hello. Yeah, hello, good afternoon. Yeah. Well, when did you start the donor? Well, I started in 2018. Yeah, in 
He's not here in credit. He said his daughter do the, went there and did the same thing that you are doing now, oh. so he wants to donate to you. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Yeah. Um, it, 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 I told him that you said your daughter did, went there and did the same thing that he's doing right now, right? Oh, she's there. Oh, yeah, his daughter is there. At Edna Manley doing the same thing that you're doing now. What is the daughter's name? Brittany. Edna Manley. No, which one at the school? Drama school. Drama school. She got to our? Drama school, music school, huh? She was, she was in drama. Oh, she graduated. She graduated? She got food. Says she has what? Oh, she leaves. She's not there. Oh, that's why I don't know her. Okay. Everything came true, so she leaves. Yeah. Okay, so you want to donate to him, you say, right? You know the procedure. All right, yes. Thank you. Yes. So he's saying that his daughter was going there, but she had to leave because her papers came through. Um, some people too much, to Lord Jesus. So we don't. So guys, you know the procedure for those on um, Facebook. You know how to do it on YouTube. I don't know if I should have been for IG. Or um, ever I forgot the IG um personnel. I may have the phone. And we come say I'm gonna set up the next phone. So make you have three phones up and running. I can't go on IG you now. Because guess what? On this phone you then and the ring. Um Yes, Dylan mother. Um she she went to look for my mother, so you can call her later. All right, don't have the Maricho. Hello, good afternoon. Good afternoon, can you take a flight, please? Yes, go ahead. Yes. Yeah, you're off the line. Mm hmm. Yeah, but he didn't care. He, oh, she said, hold on a second. I did bring him here to, to perform. He didn't come to perform at 99. I, he came for an interview. And, he's, and, and persons asked him to do something, and he sing a song, and she called in and asked him to do a skit. So he was saying that he was going to do it in the form of a play. But persons are saying they don't want to pressure him. So you don't see anything wrong with persons asking him to do that. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so she says she with this kid she have a problem with that, but with the singing, she do have a problem with you see, because she never even know that you could sing and you that touch she so if you want to do more singing you can do that okay. yes and she's gonna donate to you also okay. all right thank you bless you eh yes so she's saying um she don't like the skit part to put you under the pressure but you have such a beautiful voice and when you started to sing that letter i want to donate to you so you can, if you want to sing, I should they love the singing. So if you want to sing another song, you can um, do that. Okay. Mm -hmm. um. It's up to you, as I just said again. Yes. I could sing. All right. That sounds good. But uh, I think I want to sing something relaxing, or like an art.
Yeah, yeah, like when somebody put yeah. you on the spot, you, you know, it, like you ever got so many times, somebody just, and you know, it, yeah, you know, it, but it, at the moment, you can't like, remember like, nothing. Yeah, I know them feeling, you know, yeah. I don't want you to go under any form of stress. Yeah. I try to go by IG and me, and I say to me, <laughs> if you don't feel comfortable singing, don't be. So leave it. I can't remember which song to sing now. <laughs> you know what? What did one of them say, Natalie? They must stop stressing him, asking him to sing. Yes, they, they must stop stressing him. They are donating. And there's proof if they can they call at the university and check out. And if no money now, I go hand over to him. Everything I go to the school. So when I have worries, I why am I going to get to the donation? If I go directly to the school. I pressure him. What's your favorite song? Well, I listen to all That's the song. And, um, Who's your favorite artist? Uh, me too. You know, I'm a favorite artist, but me don't know this song. Me know like a party, and then me sing da 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 da, and then we're gone. <laughs> well, the thing I want to tell you now, you, you, you uh, listen to these songs. I don't know all words. words. Yeah. Now feel pressure of you sing. Let me answer the next call. Yeah. Hello, good afternoon. Um, hello. Hello. Yeah. Good afternoon. Yes, yes, yes. I will be paying in the school fee when, when you can give a little. Yeah, when, when, when the school fee pay, I will do the live, you can give a little something. Come with our worship. I'm more relaxed, yes. Thank you. Thank me, thank, thank Elizabeth. Black River. I get all the back crab. <laughs> she my, my, my parish. Oh. Uh, yes. Welcome. I know you've done it. All right. Thank you. You know the procedure already. Yes. Thank you. Yes. Hello. Good afternoon. Hello. Hello. Yes. Yes, Miss Okay. The pressure in him. True, true. Yes. Yes. All right. So she said she hit that. You see her. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, Are you still on the line? Yes, I am. I am I'm calling just to um, agree with the man who called in from Europe, right? Yes. The thing with people calling and asking this young man to sing. We've already established that he's got a lovely voice and he's very gifted and talented in singing. However, he did this. Him to do any more 
singing or anything like that. Let me just take a call. Hello, good afternoon. Hello, good afternoon. Yes. I'm just on our one. Uh-uh. Um, I'm sure I'm from Florida. Yeah, I know, sir, are you? Listen, let me say something to Gloria. Hold on. Yeah, I'm talking. I'm here. Gloria. Yeah. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Listen, you did not come tonight tonight for an interview, for, for um audition, right? Yeah. I already sing one song that was lovely. Listen to me and listen to me here, you know. Don't do nothing else. Okay. Don't do nothing else. One song is enough. Don't do nothing else. Alright. Alright? Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, I will let you know. She know, she know the procedure. You know the procedure? Yeah, you know, know the procedure. Uh, All right, let me take the yeah, Tamika. Yeah. Remember, I can't read out she's doing an interview. Eh? Oh, what, what number? Oh, let me see if we get Tammy. Tammy did a call. I wish I could have called back. Hello? I'm fine, Dorian. Hello. I just wanted to commend Dorian and um to be brave enough to even come to the shop to interview like to express to the public. But I see the stress on him when he sees that he's going to perform like um either in his and I don't think that's fair for him or it's himself. You don't want to donate to him based on the situation. I think that should be fair enough. And if later on the line, like you said, if he chooses to, I'm not receiving a donation. Wants to perform something or give a nice speech, then you'll have time to prepare. Prepare, yes. Disability. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. You're, you're not here to Thank you. Yes, let me see if I can get back to me. Let's go see how you are. Hi, Tommy. Hi. Yes, hold on. Go ahead. Right, um, so can we just speak to Dorian a bit? He's, yeah, a, I, he's, got, on, here, he's got on the phone. Hi, Dorian. Hi. Yeah, let's just change the tune of everything that is going on. Okay. So can I just ask? other young men to do um, a course in drama and if so what are the perks and benefits of doing such a course okay so the perks of um, drama one it helped to develop one self-esteem that's one of the strongest points um, and why I say it's one of the strongest points of the drama as I said it entails music it entails visual art, it entails um, you basically writing, you know, and um, voicing your, your thoughts, as well as it helps you to, to show a deeper connection of your culture, and not only our, um, Jamaican culture, I'm saying, um, um, categorizing culture in a sense where our ethnicity, black or our black ethnicity that we neglect a lot of times, we, in, we neglect a lot of stuff and take things for granted. Um, we grow to appreciate our culture so much, things that we do in our everyday life that we don't normally, we don't know why we do them. We come here, with grandmother said, we come here generation after generation saying these things, and we don't know what really stand behind these, the, 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 these saying or these, you know, these doing. So we just continue doing them, and we, we just continue, just, you know, continue, continue, continue. And drama help us, help me and a whole as a person, because I, I can only talk about me. It helped me to appreciate my culture. And there's still some stuff that I really don't like about our culture, but I really feel like 
within this 21st century we should all be dedicated you know knowing that we have smartphone and once you have a smartphone the, 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 the possibility that you might have a plan you might have wi-fi access you have a thing called google where you can always use to educate yourself yes it's always my best friend it's always you know and we tend to use we tend to use our smartphone for negative things true and um we we I, I really want to just highlight the fact that that is a part of one aspect of the culture that I don't like within our society. Because when you look, when, it's, when I zoom in on other culture, like for example, you know, a Chinese culture, and I will always talk about that culture, they build fast. And the reason why they, 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 they build as a nation fast is because they stick together. And they help each one, they believe in a, a, a thing called each one help one. one. And that's how they, 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 they grow and they grow in, in, in other areas, in other countries, just like how they're growing fast in our country. And um, not string from the, the question that you asked, but I just wanted to just highlight that. <laughs> As I said, because drama has done so much for me, um, if I was, it's very therapeutic, and um, that's why I said I want to become a drama therapist um, in the future. You hardly find drama therapists in Jamaica, yes, um, but um, it's it's something that I feel work would would help a lot of persons, knowing that um, we are stressed. We 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 are a nation that is under pressure. And everybody is facing stress in so many different ways. Drama and a whole as well. Sorry, just to interject. So, for example, um, these young boys where they have like behavioral challenges or challenges, they think that instead of um, getting them into drama therapy, they should be getting them into the football. It would be good to say, okay, go drama classes because that would help them to act out how they're feeling, and then you know, with the whole group of persons, like-minded persons. That could also help to build, um, you know, various characteristics within them. Yes, it do. It do. Because uh, drama, drama is a very strong it, 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 um, theater, I should say. Theater, because drama is so broad, you know. But theater on a whole help you to devise. It help, it help you, as I said, um, from the, like, the first part of the, 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 the life that... Um, Sorry, I think that, Hold up the phone. I yeah, know that yeah, number yeah. is showing. Yes. No, no, your number is not showing. Okay. So, um, right. Theater on a whole, you would normally, one of my lecture would say, you know, go on the road, look on people. That's one thing. Take character from people. You can write a play based on what you see, based oh, on yeah. their dialogue, and based on how they behave. One of the main reasons for him saying this is the fact that you actually know how people why why person do things right you see what is going on in the environment yes yes i'm going to call the person after i finish okay yeah okay yeah. so that's okay and um you basically acting out all of, all of the things and that you are going through or what you have seen, it will help you to have a better appreciation of yourself as an individual. And it's a fact that you know that through drama, being on stage, it doesn't mean that, you know, you have to act a particular way. Some people say, oh, you have to act like, you know, a certain way, you know. And you, 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 you don't have a set where you just act, you just be, be anything you want to be. Yes. Being, being dramatic, it could be sadness, happiness, um, being loud, vulnerable, being strong, 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 being doing drama you can write your songs and we know a lot of jamaicans we jamaican love write music everybody wants to become an artist you, know? <laughs> you can write how you feel <laughs> 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 
And in the process of acting, there is a lot of process that you have to go through, um, put your character through, you have to ask a question, some serious question, why am I acting this way, what drives my character? And um, you doing that to yourself as an individual, you would actually know where you stand, where you, where, what you should work on, what you should, you know, what you should leave in your life and what you should just, you know? Yeah, basically, basically, okay. basically, I hate that. <laughs> okay, and the final thing, because um, it is a regular occurrence where many students in Jamaica from here you know, across all boards are struggling with fees. If there's anything more that the government or the private sector could do to assist these students, what do you think, in your opinion, that would be? Um. Well, apart from the scholarship that, you know, persons would offer, I would say, I would say, you, you know, this kind of woman on the spot still, but, yeah. um, you know, you, 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 you look out from education. Can you make it more affordable? Because we That's one. Because we're giving students going to the Ukraine to do their medical studies. Do you think affordability is a big key? So if the prices were, um, the fees were less than, it would be more affordable for students. That would be one, that they, the one of the, what, that would one be, be one key factor that could help our education system because um, looking, zooming into education and you hear other persons say, oh, I have like 10 CXC and them have them a lot of CXC but they don't want to take on no school, jobs. no, there's no job and the, the fact the fact the factor of you graduating from school um with a bachelor's degree or a master's and not getting a job that's one of the things that persons really run from so i would say yeah. the job opportunity in jamaica isn't that good but um having an education they say a good education will never decay will never will never, will never vanish never away, vanish away. But you know, having um, having money, money will always come and go. But when you invest in yourself, you come into education, Ola! you will go a far away because you, know, you may not, you you may not, even though you may, you may graduate from school with a bachelor's degree, it's something else. A bachelor's degree is like a starting point. You can go into other Ola! areas as long as you assert yourself. You will, you will reach somewhere in that. Yeah. Yes, thank you, Tommy. Sorry for the nice guys. Yes, she coming. See how this? Yeah, we up the road and stuff. Yes. Come here! Yeah! Yeah! Sorry, guys. Yeah! Sorry about that, guys. Sometimes I don't remember semi ghetto, yeah? Sometimes I don't have to remember semi ghetto. Alright? I can take the pig out of the mud, you can't take the mud out of the pig. Alright. Nobody know you that, Natalie. Uh -huh. Then you hear me a call for all I know. Yeah, my body here. Right? <laughs> uh. They're not here. They don't hear. So, guys, this is, uh, we're waiting on Miss Paula for me to inform her. <laughs> I wonder what the one saying I come with me, Natalie. I'm not done, are you frightened? I'm not done, I can't hear me now. <laughs> Dana Maya text me. OMG. Anyway, so Dorian is here. I'm going to introduce her to Miss Paula. She's coming from church. And so I'm going to act, let the door let her know that there's a, a, a marathon going on for you. So, guys, Auntie Dana here. <laughs> 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 so, 
Auntie Dana here. If you are watching or you just tuned in, we have Dorian here, a student of the Edna Mali School of the Visual Arts, and he's doing drama, and he's in a rear of $460,000, and he's asking for Auntie Dana and the Plankateria to help to pay up his school fee for him to go back to school, for him to continue schooling. So if you would love to donate to Auntie Dana, um, the admin has pinned the number right on the screen for Miss Carol. Miss um, Paula is coming, so she'll give us a little rundown as to what where you can donate to um, and where she'll give you all that information. So if you really would like to assist Dorian, please guys, Auntie Dana is asking you to find out to send the money come and then we'll pay it right here on live with your name that you give us i might not be able to call all of you but that is why i want the names so if you're giving it to dorian of john dog so this is from john dog this is from red ear donna black ear donna or pink ear donna and the name that you give that is what we will use if you don't want to give a name and you want to use your current name because you're sewing into education you can also do that all right so bless up yourself and if you send it to curves by tina they will take 500 dollars for the bearer fee from each transaction if you send it to um western union then paula will have to get somebody to send to pick it up and it's two thousand dollars to pick up a hundred dollar and i think it's fifteen hundred dollar to pick up a thousand dollar because we have to send persons there um the last time curves by tina Carol, Carol didn't take anything from hers. She don't take any donation for um, beer or fee. Carol just um, asked somebody to do it for her and bring it to her, so nothing came out of it. Um, so, but Curl by Tina, she have to use beer and stuff like that to deal with her business. So she has to take a five hundred dollar from the fee. Rushmore, they don't take anything either. But they don't give up money, I have to ask them permission for them to give me money. They don't like giving up money, they only give groceries or whatever. But they will oblige me sometimes if I call and talk to Miss Debbie, she will do it. And there, so you can do that. All right, there was a lady who, oh, let me get it to my picture. I'd send $20 for the lady downtown, 20 US. And it come to 2,900 Rushmar said it. I never saw that. Um, Rushmar said she got that after I video. She didn't know the person just sent $20. So I will reach out to that person. I'll call you on the live. All right. So anything else? Paula! Did you reach? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, she didn't reach it. I will go check up from it. <laughs> up on the ear, she over. Yes. So anything you guys would like? Um to ask you can call her uh, until then I have a meeting at one and it's now or one o'clock may about 10 minutes can spare yes but tell to tell auntie say I piece me you know <laughs> I put the palace key when I saw the coming yeah um so that's it and we'll be sending to Rushmore um and Miss Debbie thank you him get water already. Where the water is? If not, if I didn't come and find him something, see him have it there. Eh? Uh, Miss Paula! How is she there? I'll let you all learn that. Let me go look here. Yes, Miss Paula. She said she died. Somebody here. Yeah, I'll let you all After that, sorry, I'll do it in the light. Yes, Miss Paula, I'll go. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I've not really met a hot marketing person of my phone in the last stage, you know. <laughs> yeah, when we transform into something different on stage and the light on me, then I take on one whole different character. And, but I hope in the future when I'm in a play, well, it's not really, I won't say, because they don't allow it on video. I don't know how you could, um, how you want to you know, get to see me in action, but, well, the next time I'm going to be on, 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 on this live, I promise you all that I will do a little performance, you know, something going to get me, at least, see me in, doing something, something, yeah, 
You say uh, you have a beautiful smile. Uh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> really, then, for me, I'm going to show the door. I can't see the young man. <laughs> You're perfectly showing. <laughs> but um, apart from that, apart from that, you probably might, you know, probably might because uh, um, that in the future. So somebody did that with one okay, so we should go and show them. In the future, in the future, I want to go in some Jamaica, some places, and hopefully I could get a chance to have a daily address or be a part of her group. That's one of my dreams. And uh, I have so much things I want to accomplish. So you're a handsome young man, very intelligent. Thanks. Thanks. Yes. All right, guys. So until then, I spin the camera now. Thank you, the beautiful Natalie, who is very courteous to hold the phone. We're gonna cut the live because Auntie Dana has to go somewhere. Yes. Um, yes. No, no, not now. Yes, yes. Tell me the pan the life now, please, yes. Uh, and um RJ is here, not your money. Just two or no, four. Uh him sweet one more time. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes. So bless up on yourself guys, reach out to Miss Paula. You guys know, and if you're not getting through to Miss Paula, reach out to Auntie Donna, Curved by Tina Rushmar, Miss Carol, Tommy Faye. For those who in England, I'm going to put Tommy Faye, you know, she always collect. For those who in England and you want to donate, reach out to Tommy Faye, she will get the donations to me, just like how she always do. All right, so yes, Tommy Faye, and a lot of you have Tommy Faye number, and already, you know, and already, all already, are out to get through to her. Yes, Tammy Faye in England, she, she loves these things. She's passionate about students. Yes, and um, I call out all the names. You know the procedure for both most of you and here. For the new persons, call Miss Paula or reach out to one of these light numbers and that is the admin pin right there. All right, and remember, everything will be done. Does Dorian have a Facebook? I don't use Facebook. <laughs> yes. You don't use Facebook? So, oh, you see me. Where you see me on? Um, Instagram. You're on Instagram? Yeah. What is your name on it? Dorian. That's my name, Dorian. Okay. Dorian. He doesn't use Facebook. He's on Instagram as Dorian. All right. We should not do a live over there for the IG people then. Because we have a lot of donors over there who don't use Facebook. So, I'm going to pop over IG for a few minutes. All right. Meet me over I IG. On, I can see me on Facebook because I have a closed account. Then, you know, but it's not a possibility that I'm Oh, like, you have an account over there? Because I don't really use it. But he doesn't use it. All right. So we're going to pop over IG for a little two minutes. I haven't done a live over there in a long time. All right. So I'm going to meet me over IG. Bless you. Peace out.